Two schools in York County have so many students and teachers out with the flu that they both shut down for the day today. Hello again, I'm Pat Callahan. And I'm Amanda Hill and for Cindy Williams tonight, York County has been hit especially hard by the flu. At last check, nearly a thousand people have tested positive. But no county has been immune to the spread of the virus. The latest numbers from the Maine CDC show that in the week ending January 24th, 685 people tested positive for a strain of flu. 29 of them were hospitalized, two of them died. When looking at the entire season so far, more than 3,000 people have tested positive, 10 have died. And as for those two schools in York County, they plan to reopen tomorrow. That's after spending the weekend trying to make sure the flu doesn't spread when the kids come back. NECN's Dustin Wlodkowski has the story from Standish. At the Edna Libby Elementary School, empty parking lots and playgrounds. No, it's not February vacation, <coughs> but the flu. 35% of kids here sick. Well, it's unusual for me. It's the first time I've had to do it. Despite containment efforts last week, Superintendent Paul Penna says 75 youngsters have the flu. It's a similar story at Sanford Christian Academy, where a third of kids and staff have caught the virus. It progressed all through the week until yesterday we made that decision that this was really an outbreak. The closures will allow the insides of the schools to be decontaminated and hopefully prevent more kids from getting sick. That means wiping down desks, spraying surfaces, and giving everyone time to rest up become less contagious. It does look like this day has uh, bought us some time for kids to get better. In Standish, staff are even reworking the cafeteria, fogging the school building. Custodial staff is doing it and the cafeteria staff is reorganizing what they do there. We're going to change how we distribute food, have less contact between students and with products. If everything goes to plan, both schools will be back open Tuesday, allowing a full three days for the virus to dissipate, taking last weekend into account. That said, school leaders don't expect the problem to suddenly stop and have one simple message for parents. If your kids got the flu, stay home. It is affecting the community at large. If we're sick, we don't need to be out in the community. And of course, if your children have fevers or not feeling well, we're asking them to keep them home for a day or two. In Standish, Dustin Blakowski, New Center Rain.